welcome back to my channel. I know it's been a hot minute since I last uploaded a review video for you all and the simple reason for that is I've just been busy getting on with my day to day and haven't really had time to sit down and film a proper video for you all until now. I'm sure you can guess what the video is all about today by this box here. So without further ado, let's get into it. So the product I want to talk to you about is the Mini Falabella crossbody bag. I will actually put all the details in the description box, you know, the actual name, the model, um, where you can buy it from and all of that stuff, which I will also get onto. But I wanted to mention the packaging, guys. The packaging is very, very, very nice. So sustainable and environmentally friendly packaging. You open this up. I'm just going to show you. You have the dust bag and it comes within its own dust bag and inside you have the bag so I am going to get onto it I will do a close-up and show you what this bag looks like close up as you can see it's a slim bag with this gunmetal sort of hardware and the crossbody chain it has a sort of magnetic sort of opening and closure and inside there is a um, small pocket I guess for cards and then the actual big pocket in itself so very very simple bag it's a leather free bag so this material here is not leather I believe it's actually polyester and polyester mix it has a small um, little Stella McCartney sort of logo with a little I guess what is this I don't want to call it a key ring but a little sort of charm and then it has the iconic iconic um chain detail on the bag so Stella McCartney is known for integrating chains into the sort of ends of um her bags or the edges rather so that is what is um achieved here as well with the, just a little drop down of the chain there this is essentially a crossbody bag so you know you put it over um your shoulder you can um as with a lot of bags double it up so double up the chain to make it into almost a kind of shoulder bag and how you do that is you just kind of double up the chain you bring it through and you can have almost like a um, little shoulder bag i essentially like to use this as a crossbody bag overall i love this bag i used it so much earlier this year i went to milan and i used it pretty much every single day it's a great everyday kind of bag if you're you know just pop running errands or you're popping into the city you can also even use it in the evening and it doesn't really look out of place or too casual um because of the sort of detailing on the chain um but at the same time, you can really just casual it up and use it, you know, wear it with jeans or you can wear it with, you know, a nice flowy dress. It's a very versatile bag. At first, I thought that the actual material of the bag wouldn't be as structured um, and I was a little bit worried about that. But as you would have seen in, you know, the previous clips and the cutaways, it's actually, although it's not very sturdy, it's still quite structured. Um, so even though it's made of like material, it's it's still got a bit of structure to it i like the pocket inside because it just means you can pop your cards in there or if you have any um anything extra you want to put a little bit separate you know be it cash be it cards be it you know a key or two whatever it might be you can sort of separate within the bag but the bag on its whole is one pocket um I love the gunmetal, the sort of silver gunmetal hardware. For me, it makes it really versatile as opposed to having like gold um, or, or another colour. It means I can wear it every day, um, casually with like, you know, my casual clothes. But if I do want to dress it up in the evening, I, I still have a, a nice pretty bag to wear with, you know, a lovely dress. I have had no transfer onto clothes, no rubbing no sort of wearing away of the material and i've worn this quite a lot over time it is said that the material will sort of patina sort of fade over time and give it a lived in um worn look so overall do i like this bag yes would i recommend it yes because i think it's a very 
practical bag, but still being very sort of um, eco-friendly, eco-conscious, um, and still being stylish. Now, as well. when I bought this bag, I think at the end of last year, it was retailing for around £475, which is what I paid, but I believe now it retails for £495. If I'm completely honest, this colour, I'm not too sure if it's available on the Stella McCartney website. Um, it may have been a limited edition. I'm completely not too, I'm not too sure. However, it is available in various different colours. So you can get this in black, grey, a light blue. And I believe now you can even get this in sort of summer colours. So you can get this in sort of an orange and a gold with sort of gold hardware as opposed to the silver, which I think is super nice for summer. Also, if you're looking for a bag which is a little bit more dressy because I feel like gold really does dress up um, whatever it is. So be it a bag, be it a belt, you know, be it um, jewellery, I think gold really makes uh, an outfit, an item look a little bit more dressy. I purchased my bag from Stella McCartney's website, but you can buy the bags from Farfetch, net a -Porter, um, a few various different places, so I will link them all in the description. If you are looking for some money off, please always keep an eye on the description box because that is where I share a lot of codes um and links for where you can buy these items at a discount and that kind of thing because who doesn't love a discount i think that is it for me short and sweet if you do have any particular questions about this bag please leave them in the comments and i will get around to messaging you back if you want to message me over on instagram please feel free to i will leave my links in the description box Thank you so much for watching and I will see you in my next video. Bye everyone.